Detroit City Distillery is releasing its limited edition honey bourbon once again on Friday. The award-winning bourbon is finished with raw honey from bees in the D's rooftop hives that are actually on top of the distillery's rooftop. That is very cool. We're joined now by Michael Force, the co-owner of Detroit City Distillery. And we were just talking about before the show. Yeah. I've been there before. It is such a cool spot. If you haven't been, you have to go. So yeah, thank you thank so much you. for being yeah, here. Yeah, pleasure to be here. Yeah, I've been in Easter Market over nine years now. It's, it's so cool such a cool environment. Okay, so award-winning yes. honey bourbon. Tell yes. me about it. So this is a product we do once a year. Uh, it lines up with uh, the honey harvest annually, but people ask for it all year I from bet. all over the world. Uh, so it's always a really exciting time for us. So uh, we take our award-winning uh, bourbon and we finish it with honey. We have hives on the roof of our whiskey factory. We partner with this really cool nonprofit, Bees in the D. So we've been working with them, I think, six or seven years now. They have hives in 75 locations uh, across Metro Detroit. We were some of their first. So this is always a really special one for us. And, you know, like honey is like the most craft thing on the planet. Like thousands of bees travel all over the city, gather pollen and nectar and make honey on our roof. So this is like the truest taste of Detroit. That's so Whiskey cool. made in Detroit, honey made in Detroit, um, when the two come together, it's pretty sweet. And you guys are actually increasing production, right? Yes. So we doubled production again, wow. second year in a row. Um, you know, this is one that we're trying to share with the masses. Um, so this is going to be statewide this year. All your, you know, favorite retailers and local liquor stores. But um, we came out with one other special way to drink this. So this is our first ever ready to serve honey old fashioned. Love. So you just pour it over ice. Uh, it's our honey bourbon, honey from the roof, uh, house-made uh, aromatic and uh, orange bitters. And it's just an amazing old-fashioned. So just pour over ice and enjoy and repeat. And now as tempting as it is for us to pour it up right now, you kind of already went over it, but yeah. what's the experience like? Tell me what it yeah. tastes like. So honey bourbon is like a really well done I hate calling it flavored whiskey because I think that gets a bad rap. It's not like one of your like sugar bombs that yeah. you get from some of the main brands. Uh, it's a subtle sweetness. We actually finished the bourbon inside of a barrel that we aged honey in. So there's actually barrel aged honey that kind of comes along with this too. This is Bees in the D, but it provides a subtle sweetness and it builds kind of on your palate as you drink it. So it's kind of a transformative drink, not overly sweet. Um, you know, really beautiful, sweet notes. It kind of decreases some of the heat. It's a hundred proof bourbon, mm -hmm. a little sweet heat on it. Um, and it's just a really fun drink. Well, uh, I'm going to snack really some bottles for, for after the yes. show. So Michael, thank you so much for being here. And we keep saying how much you need to visit. There will actually be a tasting party on Friday. So make sure you check out Detroit City Distillery. And once again, Michael, thank yeah. you so much for being yeah, here. Yeah, this Good Friday. this season. Yeah, no, November 10th, Friday, 8 a.m. online and then in person at 4. All right, listen.